guys and welcome back well cat williams long awaited netflix stand-up special uh, aired a couple of days ago yes now the special was called world war three and uh this is the second stand-up comedy he's done for netflix which the last one was in i believe 2018 2017 so all Cat Williams fans were waiting for this moment. Well, uh, to say that his fans were kind of disappointed would be kind of putting it lightly. Yes, fans called Cat Williams out on this one. I mean, uh, wow. They went to Twitter and they really roasted Cat. I mean, um, I don't know if you saw it, but I saw it. And to say that I am a Cat Williams fan, I am so much a Cat Williams fan. But it was hard to watch. It really was. Uh, I don't know what was wrong. Um, but uh, I'm going to tell you about what some of his fans had to say on Twitter. Now, this one person said, I love Cat Williams, but his new stand-up on Netflix is not it. Disappointed. Mm. Now, another one said, tonight I watch you try to fight and save your comedy career in your latest Netflix special. You lost that fight. Hmm. Now, another one said this Cat Williams is nervous laughter waiting for him to stop repeating himself and say something funny. I ain't even finished it yet. It's tough to watch. It's like he wrote it on the way to the venue and made up what he could right on stage. Hmm. Now, last but not least, this one said Cat Williams, what the is this <laughs> well guys uh like i said i don't know what happened i you know it's just it was uh based on conspiracy theory and uh you know some things was a little funny but you know normally with cat williams everything is funny you're rolling you know you're laughing but even the audience, they didn't, you know, it was just hard for me to watch because the audience didn't even give him love, you know. They were clapping. Some were clapping just to be clapping. But, uh, you know, I don't know. I don't know, Cat. Cat has seen so much in the entertainment business, and he's, I, I, I don't know. I don't know what happened, but Cat... You know, uh, uh, dust yourself off and try again, cause uh, that one what that didn't do it for me and many of your fans. Y'all, did y'all watch it? Well, if you watched it, if you don't, go ahead and watch it and 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 just comment. Just press that comment and comment about it. But it wasn't the old cat. I didn't, you know, I don't know if he's off his meds or he needs to be on meds, or what, I don't know. But it was not the funny Cat Williams, you know. And, uh, you know, with the uh, comedy and the culture being changed now, uh, but, you know, in Cat's uh, stand-up, he didn't talk about people in the audience. He didn't talk about, you know, touchy subjects. So I'm not going to blame it on that. It's just... Uh, cat is just, and I mean, you have the right to bomb because uh, everyone bombs. I guess Richard Pryor bombed a couple of times, you know, he did, you know. So, um, cat bombed this one. I, I'll, I'll give it thumbs down. I give it a hated it, but uh, cat does just dust yourself off and try again. Hey, you got a friend, you got a fan for life with me, so, uh, you know. But I got to tell it like it is. It, it was not. It was disappointing. And I didn't even finish watching. No, I just, I just cut it off. Mm -hmm. And read the last rights. Just cut it off. <laughs> but you watch it if you had. And if you had, press that comment button. And tell me how you, uh, what did you think about the, the comedy? You know, because, uh, you know, 
I might didn't see what you saw, but <laughs> if you did like it. So I would love to hear from you. All right, guys, that's it for me. Thank you so very much for watching my video. I hope that you will like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And as always in parting, be blessed, y'all. Bye.